Hello, welcome back, guy. Um, sorry that uh, it's been taking too long for uh, making the video. Uh, everything here in Denver is uh, now is almost back to normal. Uh, we are back to work. Uh, kind of a little bit busy here. Uh, but today, I want to show you how I poured the K20A2 oil pump. Why we have to do in this? Because due to the race engine, we rip all way higher than normal. So the stock oil pump is they didn't design for that high rip. So what we do is we have to port from the inside of the oil pump. That I will show you later. And also, we will shim the spring. So kind of bring up the pressure a little bit. All right, let's get to work. You can see right there, it's the factory machine. You see the edge is like razor, razor sharp edge. So this create a lot of cavitation. So what we do is we smooth all that out. So uh, the tool I use is a uh, uh, quarter inch uh, uh, air uh, die grinder, air die grinder, and then a uh, couple uh, quarter inch steel uh, bur bur by bit. So I have this the short one, and this the long one that uh, I be able to uh, read the deep inside the corner. You see the first cut is success. Uh, you can dry it out until the dowel pin almost like thin like a paper. This will be okay, no problem with that.
this one gonna go on the K24 block so we need to trim the housing to make it fit so what you can do is you use the marker mark it right here just about half of that and this end right here cut out like this to be able to I don't know you can see it yeah. break it easy yeah. you guys see right now the sharp edges are gone you know Nice and clean. To shim the spring, I use a 10 millimeter washer. Drop it in there. Make sure it sit all the way down. all right the pump is nice and clean it's ready to go uh, so this is uh, the idea that's how this is how i do it so uh, i share with you guys they don't take long to do it take about 45 minutes to do it you can do it yourself and uh, with the stock pump you uh, can put it and turn it into better pump so it's gonna keep your engine more healthy and more horsepower of course all right so that's be all for today thank you for watching i see you guys next time